I must must sort of tell you a little bit of the story about where we started this. A uh, few months back, almost a year back, we sort of met up with uh, Principal Madam Secretary and also with the Director Secretary, Director Madam, and told them that why don't we do an Indian Responsible Tourism Rajasthan chapter? And the first instance they said it's a very good idea, but how do we do it? So we said no, we will look, look deep into the deep into the context, look deep into the evaluation of the of and look into the process of finding who are the responsible tourism practitioners in Rajasthan. So we all applied our mind. We sort of tried reaching out to the lowest of the practitioners across the state. And I must share with you in this forum that we got 150 responses. Now, when I asked, when I asked uh, Shwedi, who is the project editor, I said, 150, is that enough? She said, well, for the first time, maybe it is enough, but in Rajasthan, there are more than 2,000 or 3,000 odd practitioners. So the job has just begun. So it's a, it's a long way to go. We will have to spread the word of what the Responsible Tourism Awards means to the smallest of the practitioners in the state. We have been doing the Responsible Tourism Award at the summit for the last eight years. It's called the Indian Responsible Tourism Awards. We started it small. Today we get about 800 to 900 applications and only a few and a handful win the awards. And some of them are automatically chosen by WTM. And now, of course, we have also partnered with the GSTC. So therefore, there will be a lot more recognition that they will get globally. And we want to extend the same kind of support to the state winners as well.